Greetings, Dambi Warriors. As a general rule, uh, Dambi Bouts, percussive music is always uh, present in the arena. There you see the musicians beating on the primary kalangi drums and the smaller kutunku. To play the take and individualize summons for all our boxers, each and every one of them. Straight to the match and Garikua Chindo is no new face in this arena featuring Dambi Warriors with 472 and 63 versus Shagon Mokwa. Mark delivers an overhand punch, pouring the musicians into a gyration mode. Like as uh, witness a great rise in this arena. Like attempt to grapple and both are locked in a series of overhand, but none seem to be going down. Tit for tat, trusting non-stop relentlessly. Overhand continuously. Mokwa smartly snuck in a very beautiful uppercut right there. And both fighters keep going at it again, non-stop. Referee eagle eyes, watching out for any, you know, technical fouls that might occur. They are tiring out, nonetheless. Uh, needs one from Black, throws Mokwa off, but he quickly finds his foot. They resume their return to for that overhand. And a beautiful back clip with a sweet back hook there on Mokwa. Staggers. Or against a consciousness. And that point there for Chindu Black, who's bringing experience into matches like this. Umpire attempts to break this round up. Beautiful first round, to quite an intense day. Chindu Black struts to the musician arena and draws energy from the rhythm of the pitting drums. Married the spritz water on him. Beautiful south sights and sounds from the Dambi Warriors Arena. Shagon Mokwa. Round two is about to resume and let's go. But draws first blood, pushed themselves away. Black misses over Hamoka strikes with an uppercut back hood combo, beautiful. And they resume the pound for pound attack mode, which gets the crowd going. Beautiful, like this is just what the crowd wants to see. Another miss again, another miss from Mokwa used by Black to deliver two hooks. Beautiful, brick for brick, pound for pound. No fighter is relented in here. Black loses his foot there for a second. Really intense and quite frankly, we are surprised Mokwa is holding his own in here. Impressive to go toe to toe against Chindo Black. A wide guess, you know, that even Chindo Black is perplexed that uh, he hasn't really taken charge of this uh, bout. The ref separates the fight. And uh, Chindo Black uh, smiling over there. Yes, I mean, see this replay. To White Chindu Black gets caught up in uh, throwing over hands. Mokwa stylishly always sneaks in a beautiful uppercut there, which catches a uh, uh, Black off guard. You'd expect someone like him, of his caliber of fighter, to bring in more experience there. Yeah? Um, Crowd is a bit silent. I don't think he has put up a good performance, or maybe they are just a bit surprised that Chago Mokwa has, uh, you know, really taken time to show the stuff he's made of. I mean, he has shown what he's made of, and he deserves to get another bout real soon in this arena. They will attempt to go at it to a third round. I think the umpire wants to call it off so we can allow other fighters to have their own day. Mokwa smiles. <laughs> I think he himself is impressed by what has happened yesterday. 
they salute the crowd and uh, would leave to battle another day. We turn out of events. I mean, stay safe out there during this period. Subscribe to our channel and may the Feast of Danby Warriors be with you. Thank you.